Hello viewers, welcome to my channel, myself Sultan, an expert data driven digital marketer. Today I am going to show you in this video how to delete a Google Tag Manager container. Sometimes it happens that we don't need any more uh, a Google Tag Manager container, so we need to delete that. How to do that? Today, I will show you. At first, why? What we have to do is go to our Google Tag Manager account. Let's go. Google Tag Manager. We can delete our Google Tag Manager container in just a few seconds. Let's see, this is my Google Tag Manager account and this is my container, container name, and let's go to container. This is my Google Tag Manager container, let's go to admin section. This is my account, Sultan Shop, and this is my container, uh, sultanshop.com and i'm going to delete this container so uh, let's go to container settings and then see here there are three dot um, there is three dot options let's click here there are delete options click here delete and then see uh, uh, it asks you uh, uh, if you are sure or not and if you delete this container, then this container will be removed uh, after 30 days permanently. And if you want to re restore your container, then you have to restore it uh, in within 30 days. And after that, it will be permanently deleted. So, uh, as I don't need this container anymore, I'm going to delete it permanently. Let's delete it. Uh, let's see here this uh, trash can my container is in trash can so it will be a permanent deleted after 30 days so that's it viewers uh, like my video share it and must subscribe my channel and uh, one more thing if you need any help uh, with Google Tag Manager, Google Tag Manager or Google Analytics, Google Ads, Facebook Pixel, and uh, uh, Google Conversion Tagging, etc. Please contact me and my contact info in the description. So, uh, let's see in a, another video. Goodbye.